This is a story about a boy named Alex. Alex Kasari. Alex was a white Muslim. His parents were based in Italy, and they were Christians. But he never believed in any specific religion. When it came to the topic of faith, he was alone. Alex was a partier. He was your typical high school student. Went to parties, drank, smoked, did everything to haram. However, he began to think that there was something more to life than just partying every day. That's when Alex discovered Islam. Islam was something that he heard about on the internet, but when he researched it, he found a true love for it. He fell in love with the Quran, translating its words and letting its poetry flow through his brains. He did his best to do all his prayers every day, and he began to call himself a Muslim. He was a proud Muslim. However, when all the kids at school found out about Alex's new hobby, Alex's new religion, they laughed. They got angry. They pushed and shoved him. They didn't want him near them. A white Muslim, they said to themselves, was something impossible. They began to call him a terrorist. And they told him to leave. Leave everything he once had. Even though Alex was separated from mankind, he knew Allah was always there beside him, through the bad and the good. He told himself that if there was ever a day, a chance, where he could show off the pure beliefs of Islam, he would take that chance and grasp it until Islam was finally understood. Alex finally got his chance when he saw one of his old friends from high school getting mugged in an alleyway. He thought to himself, if I can prove myself in Islam right now, maybe he'll believe as well. Alex thought to himself, what do I do? But his instincts finally kicked in and he charged into the fight. Alex fought to save his friend, and although he fought bravely, in the end, tragedy struck. Just one last time. Fighting his life, Alex died a hero and a good believer.